most of you are not aware that uh, I sort of followed the Coastal Carolina football team around and interviewed Coach Bennett from time to time. He was kind enough to let me interrupt some practice sessions and some team meetings and some post-game speeches with a few personal questions. I want to share a little of those interviews with you. Excuse me. Excuse me, Coach Bennett. I'd, I'd like to know what you thought when you proposed to Melanie and she said yes. But that ain't worth going out and celebrating all night about, you understand? Uh, I guess I understand. Well, did you say anything else to her about your relationship? I'm going to keep you humble. This is kind of personal, Coach, but what about the time your wife insisted on getting Botox and those collagen injections to kind of make her lips puff out a little bit? From this moment on, you understand all that bull about being young is gone. It is gone. But, Coach, uh, I understand you have two beautiful children, Hayes and Jeb, but it's my understanding you'd like to have 10 or 12 more kids. I want to know if you talked it over with your wife and what you said to her about it. This right here is our defining moment. We got a golden opportunity to grow as a family. Okay, enough about all that. We know you have a great coaching staff. We know Moose Cagle is a great AD. John Martin does a, a great job as your sports information director. You got all kind of good people working behind the scenes at Coastal Carolina University. But just between you and me, let's talk for a second about uh, Drew Watson. Drew Watson told me confidentially, he thinks it's time that you move over and let him be the head coach and call the shots. What would you say to Drew about that? If you want it bad enough, you can get it. If you want it bad enough, you can get it. On a serious note, all things considered, what's the most important thing you could say to your football team? Without him, ain't none of us nothing. This goes to our Heavenly Father. It's going to have his name on it. I'm going to tell you something. Those on this team that ain't believers, with all the devotions we've had this year, you got to recheck your life. You got to recheck your heart. We're very blessed to be here at this university. Very blessed to have this opportunity. And you are every one of you here. We're very blessed to have you here. Don't do anything. Don't ever do anything to throw away that blessing and take a chance on it. Everybody with me? Yes, sir.